Shut up, Alex! Or Phoenix, I'll god damn take it. Take two! Take number two. Take number two! Hello and welcome everybody to the Phoenix and Glitchy Talk Shit Show! I <laughs> fucked up! Again! <laughs> this video! The topic of this video is ringtones on your damn phone! Shut up! Jesus, don't yell at the viewers. <laughs> Sorry. I <laughs> am. I hate myself. <laughs> oh, God. But yeah, we had some technical Oh, and hey guys, look, I actually took the fucking wrapper off my drink this time. Before we started yeah. recording. Yeah. Alright, like I said, today's video is topic is ringtones. I'm not making any money, neither of us are making money. The app I use is Zedge, uh. Free your phone. Can't really see it. Too much of a glare, blah, 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 and I won't hold it till long enough. So we're going to cut the music that we usually have playing, which this one is Do 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 by Silent Partner. Again, it's royalty-free music that we found on the YouTube um, editing section, blah, 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 video manager, or whatever. Um, I'm just going to show you ringtones that I personally have. Um... I just find different things that go, uh, whatever I can find. <sighs> now, I will say, Zedge doesn't have everything that I want to find, but it does have quite a lot. So, here we have... <laughs> if you guys know the uh, game Portal, the Portal series, and you also know... Tim Burton's A Nightmare Before Christmas... This is, the song is called, This is Aperture, to the tune of, This is Halloween. That's where that's from. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I and was then, like, I know that. Song. Yeah, right, right, right. And then I have, Portal 2 Turrets. I don't know, it goes on for a while more. And then I have the In case you guys are turret in case opera. you guys are wondering, I'm lo looking to find where I have my ringtones in my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, you really should get uh, Zedge. It's completely free. I should. I really should. It's in the Play Store. That one's quite lovely. I like that. I have... Don't judge me. Oh, no, that's not the right one. It's a fucking Darude remix. Sandstorm. It's a remix of Darude Sandstorm. I got it by accident. I love that song. I also have this one's my absolute favorite. It's called the Hater Anthem. <laughs> suck a motherfucking dick. Suck. I need you to suck send me dick. that from my phone. Suck a dick. <laughs> I have the Mass Effect in credits, which I basically got a copy of that game in or that song in every fucking form I could, including the ringtone. And I wish I could play it on our uh, YouTube channel, but I can't. So it's not royalty through for you, I don't think. I I I have an obsession with Piccolo from Dragon Ball Z. So there's this. Wow, unreal! Oh my gosh, this is amazing! <laughs> I feel incredible! Yes, 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 yes! I can win! I feel great! I can do this! <laughs> And out of context, that makes me think so many dirty things! Yes, I'm home! I'm alive! This is all a miracle! I'm awake! I'm wide awake! Okay. <laughs> That's called motivational piccolo. <laughs> no. This is Dragon Ball Z Smash It. Oh, it's a song! Oh, okay. Yeah. Dragon Ball Z up! Dragon, dragon! Watch the dragon! <laughs> then, God Hype? What the fuck is this? You, Panekian, too strong! Explain now! He fused with Kami so we could become stronger. The fuck's a Kami? Basically, God, but I'm still here! Do you really believe your own hype that much? I am the hype! <laughs> It was some goofy crackpot shit that I ended up finding, and... Oh, it's probably the abridged, uh... Yeah, like a fan dub series. or some silly shit. Then we have yeah. the Vegeta dubstep. It's pretty 
good. I'm not gonna lie, I like it. That was like it. It goes on longer, but wait, what's this? Vegeta shocked. When was it that the transformation to the legendary warrior of the Saiyan race was reduced to a child plaything? Ah, that's when Tr when Trunks and Goten transformed into Super Saiyans in front of Vegeta. Oh, I have this. I know what this is. Okay, if any of you guys remember Brandy, the singer, whose brother was Ray J, um, uh -huh. she played Cinderella in like an ABC or CBS. Rogers and Hammerstein yes. with Whitney Houston. Yes. Yes. I knew I recognized that. <laughs> and and this... yes, I know. It's a gay stereotype because <laughs> I'm in the musicals. Fuck you. Fuck it. I it's loved it. It was thing. fantastic. Cinderella is one of those only like romance shit that I'll get behind. God damn it, Disney movies. I will get behind Disney movies to the cows come home. And, and you know what? <laughs> Go ahead. That whole story has some issues. That what Cinderella? I'm surprised feminists. Yeah, I'm surprised feminists haven't well, been all over it. That's because that's shit from their childhood. I don't think they're gonna uh, aptly attack it. But this is called your best. Oh, I know what this is. Winners go home and fuck the prom queen. I looked for Sean Connery. It basically is him say it's a quote from a movie. I, I really don't know what movie, but I think it might be from like The Rock or some shit like that. And he's like, "Your best." I cannot do his voice or accent to save me. Your best. Losers always whine about their best. Winners go home and fuck the prom queen. I'm just sitting here like, ah! he just said fuck. What? Sean Connery. Ah! Then I have, okay, I think this is the one. This one is my favorite one. Why is it always claws and guns? Can't we piss off a fuzzy planet? Still dangerous, but hey, bunnies. That is apparently something that Seth Green said whilst pretending to be Joker during a uh, convention, a panel in a convention, and it's fucking glorious. Yeah, Joker is one of my favorites, I guess. There's say. also this. Sweet Jesus, I love you, Garrus. Some women find facial scars attractive. <gasps> Mind you, most of those women are Krogan. I'm not Krogan, I find it attractive. I'm good. I could be considered a Krogan, depending on who the fuck you ask. <laughs> but seriously, the way his voice kind of is like deep and raspy in that part, I'm just like, <gasps> Be still, my heart don't explode out of my chest, because then I'll explode all over him. <laughs> And then I have my favorite, one of my favorite things from Mass Effect 2, which I haven't achieved yet, but... I am the very model of a scientist Salarian. I've studied species Turian, Asari, and Batarian. <laughs> I'm good at genetics as a subset of biology because, because I am a an expert which I know is ethology. My xenoscience studies range from urban to agrarian. I am the very model of a scientist Salarian. I love Morton! He's adorable. I actually had a friend that had that whole song memorized. I I will eventually eventually do this. This one's called Rude. Oh, Rihanna. <laughs> please don't sue us, Rihanna. We oh shit, you. Rihanna! Please don't sue us. Oh, disclaimer. Did I didn't even eh. consider any of this. Disclaimer. No. We're not making money. I just no. wanted to show off my ringtones. YouTube, don't no. fucking. Ah. Now, Rihanna. Rihanna. Rihanna, we love you. We're, 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 I'm we don't have money so, for you. I'm sorry. So, 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 bitch, don't have the money. Bitch, I'm bitches sorry. don't have the money. Gucci bitch don't have the money. I'm sorry. I love you. You're awesome. Hook me up with the, uh, uh, Mads Mickelson. I want to meet that motherfucker. Yo, so also meet him. Seriously, yeah. I'm not saying more than that. Kudos on, like. Huge fucking ups on getting him to be in your fucking music video because that's amazing. 
Oh, I have this. This will get stuck in your fucking brain space. And then there's Magic Carpet Ride. Oh! Disclaimer! That was not what I was thinking. That's not what I was thinking either! I was thinking of Latin! Me too. I have this fucking thing that's ridiculous. That really hurts my ears. <laughs> that is the kind of thing that gives me heart attacks as an alarm ringtone. I have, I have this one. Which is the Beyonce song that was done for Fifty Shades of Grey. I don't like the movies. I don't support the movies or the books. Because E.L. James did not know what the fuck she was talking about. But I like the music. That's not the right one. And then we have Tsunami. Oh! And that's that. Welcome 2015. Oh! Oh! I don't know, it's so fun! It's just so fun. Also, Jeff Dunham, I love you to death. Don't don't hate and don't send your evil puppets after me either. Hello! Wake up or I kill you! Ahmed Hello. the Dead Terrorist. I love Ahmed. I know oh. you know this one, Alex. Are you? Are you? Oh, God, I love that song. Oh, I know. And these aren't actual songs I'm playing for you. I mean, they're actual songs in the real world. But I'm not playing the songs themselves from the songs. I'm playing clips that I have found on Zedge as ringtones. Please, guys, don't sue me. I love you. Jennifer Lawrence, by the way. Baby girl. God damn, I love you. I would probably eat you out if you ever asked me to. That's okay. Give me care. J Lo, I, I wouldn't go that far, but you're fucking awesome. So mm. we we can hang out. I, I'd totally be your gay best friend. Like seriously. Then I have this one, of course. <laughs> Wrong thing. That fucking made me jump. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> it made me jump too. <laughs> it just keeps going. Yet again, one of those things I never, ha I can never again use as a ringtone because I about. <gasps> If you ever seen cartoons or or even other, anything, you know, images or videos of a, a cat being so scared they end up on the fucking ceiling, stuck in the ceiling with their claws, that's what happened to me in my head. Like I have so many reactions and animated shit that happens in my head as reaction get reactions to what goes on. Also, my mother has that ringtone <laughs> for whenever I. Oh, oh, that's cute. It keeps going, of course. And then I have Lollipop, which I'm not sure which one this is. I don't know if it's Framing Hanley or the actual original version. I think it's the original. Also, Framing that, Hanley's awesome. That was not what I was expecting. Hmm. I was expecting Lollipop, Lollipop, Lollipop. No, I don't like that one. This, this is the Extreme Alarm Clock. continues on into every other type of ringtone, like, alarm clock setting that has existed. Oh, this one I have for my mother sometimes. It's your mother! Pick it up! It's mommy on the phone! Pick it up! Don't hide from me! You can't hide! Yes, it's I can! Your mother. Watch me! Don't think you can run away! I can do it! I know where you are! Pick it Fuck up! Fuck you, bitch! I'm gonna find you sooner no, or we'll, later! No. Pick it up! I'm ready for when you do, bitch. I got, I got weapons. Fuck you, mommy. <laughs> uh, let's see. There's this one. Oh! I just realized. That is a theme. That's the tune they use when they do the song. at The one song in uh, Holes. Ah, I love that movie. That's when Shia, before Shia LaBeouf was truly fucked. 
Shia Buff did that movie and the Transformers movies. And then he went fucking crazy. I'm not going to lie, yeah. And then there's this one. I think I don't think I played it yet. Have you read the book? The Holes book? Yeah, I read that in like mm -hmm. third grade. So did I. It was actually pretty good. Mm -hmm. It was, it was. I do like that they got Sigourney Weaver to play the fucking bitch. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. She was damn good. Let's see. Whip some Sigourney oh. Weaver plays that role so well. She does! Let's see, there's this one. I'm about to whip somebody's ass. Oh my god, my dad has that. Er, I'm had about that to whip son. somebody's ass. Oh, oh if you leave me alone, you're gonna, you're gonna have, have to send, send me home. Because I'm, I'm about to whip somebody's, somebody's ass. ass. I fucking love it. Oh, this one I really love. It's a. The, you know the tune Fury Lease? For release, uh, maybe. Mm. Well, this is the dubstep yeah. version. It's it's a common one that they use in uh, music boxes. Mm. But this is a dubstep version. Yeah, I know what this now. And it goes on, of course. And I just I really love it. It's really fucking good. Um, this is my guilty pleasure, honestly. I actually do have a guilty pleasure now that I think about it. I got my ticket for the long way round. I know you know this, Alex. We like some sweet company. When you say, oops, I fucked up. Damn it. My, honestly, my guilty pleasure is, well, two of them Magic Mike and Pitch Perfect. And I haven't seen the second one, and I haven't seen Magic Mike 2 yet either. I haven't seen either of either series. Oh, there's this one. Uh, this is English. another. This I is an. <laughs> you should be ashamed. This is another. Uh... Portal ringtone. Are you still there? That's the whole fucking, it's a fucking thing. turret. Yeah. Then there's Piccolo yelling at seventeen to run. Run seventeen no! That's the Cell Saga arc, obviously. This is prayers for the wicked, but I don't know what it is. Oh, it's Thane. It's Thane from from Mass Effect. That reminds me. Remind me that I need to tell you about something Portal related okay. later. Okay. Uh, I have this message alert from Joker. Message for you, Commander. Just came in over a secure channel. Then there's Hey Shep, hey, Shepard, which I have as my <coughs> ringtone. You've heard it before, guys. It's my ringtone for when pe if people text me. And then I have Joker message, which is a different one. Message coming in. Patching it through. That's why it's different. Uh, oh my god. Hmm. I just had a thought for the next game in corner. Oh, what? We need to do a video about Joker. Because there's, like, important, yes. like, that could actually be a confession video. Because you know, that's actually an important character to me personally. Yes. I just slapped um, my chest in agreement. Because like, I just thought about it when you mentioned him. It was like, oh. Light bulb. Light bulb. Blinky, blinky. Also, there's <laughs> this one again. Shepard, can oh. you hear me? No, it's Garrus <laughs> this time. Then there's Garrus again. One less to worry about. <laughs> and then this one. I'm Garrus Vicarian, and this is my rectum. I don't know. It's a blooper reel or something. It's a clip from a fucking blooper reel with the voice actors for Mass Effect. I was just about to say. I don't ever remember him saying, this is my rectum. Is my rectum. I know. I know. No, he, he never fucking said that. And that's pretty much it for my ringtones. Okay, well, I'm boring. <laughs> I'm just going to go out with it. Um, <laughs> I have three ringtones, or no, two ringtones that are not standard Samsung ringtones. Seriously? What? And they're both copywritten, so I'm not going to play them, Aww. but I will tell you what they are. <laughs> um, I know you were troubled by Taylor Swift. Yes, I like Taylor Swift. Don't get me shit for it. I will punt you. <laughs> Who, me? Um, no, not you, oh, our yeah. audience. I will yeah, punt right. all of you, collectively, at once. <laughs> um, <laughs> and Once Upon a Dream by Lana Del Rey from the Maleficent soundtrack. Uh, fucking awesome movie. If you yes. try to tell me otherwise, I will punk you. Um, 
Yeah, but those are the only two. And those are copywritten, and I would love to share them with you, but um, can't, because copyright. Can't yeah. even do it. Let's see. I'm trying to figure out how to share it. Oh, there we go. I found it. I'm going to share this with you over te text message. Oh, okay. Good thing I have my phone in my hand. I know, right? <laughs> sending. I'm Basically, I'm sending him a link for the Zedge app. Oh, cool. Good. So he can have some fucking awesome ringtones of his own. <gasps> I've never... I just, just considered that I can look for Dragon Age Inquisition. Yes, you can. Oh, 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 oh. oh I wonder if they excited. have... Because he's excited. What? That reminds me. I'm going to have to look. My face is getting hot. For that song. There's a song in Dragon Age Inquisition. Mm. That I would love to have, um... As a, um... Rain toad. Yeah, that. Ow. Thank you. Brain. Crunchy. Not going correctly. <laughs> um, crunchy brain syndrome! But yeah, yeah, so that's... That's the rundown of our ringtone. As um, you guys can see, my fan in the little corner, I just turned my fucking fan on because I'm... My face is hot. And glitchy goody red cheeks makes glitchy look drunk. Also, why am I talking in third person? I don't know. And, and honestly, like... If you guys hear any humming in the background, that's because I have a floor fan on. Mm. Because when I sleep, or like at night, for some reason, my body temperature goes up. I don't know why. Um, Whereas mine goes down. When I sleep, you would. My parents have said that you can actually put your hand this far over me mm -hmm. and feel the heat radiating off of me. Like yeah, I'm a same, fucking, same way with boneyards. Like I'm a fucking human torch. It's fucking mm -hmm. ridiculous. And if I don't have like a fan on me or something, I will wake up and just like sweat. Just pretty much the only way I can keep boneyards from cuddling me or honestly sexually attacking me in in his sleep because he literally he has groped me in his sleep and it's fucking hilarious. I'm not saying my boyfriend actually is assaulting me or anything. It's just funny. It's funny. And he doesn't even remember doing it most of the time. <laughs> And his excuse is, baby, you're just so sexy. My brain, my subconscious has to come after you. <laughs> speaking which, of which. That sounds terrible, but I think it's fucking hilarious. Speaking of which, did you ever read about the, um, there was a small, like, subset of people who took Ambien that instead of sleepwalking, they would actually have sleep sex with their partner? I think, I vaguely think that I read about that. It actually caused, I don't know what it was about it, but it caused something in their brain where they would actually have sleep sex with their partner. Their partner would wake up with their significant other asleep on top of them. <gasps> Awkward. <laughs> what do you say to that? Just, um... Uh, I, I'm glad that I'm interesting to you even while you're sleeping. I, <laughs> I, I don't know. Mm, oh, well, that reminds me. I still have to tell you about a dream I had yet last night. Um, also, yeah. um, that's our ringtone video. <laughs> yeah, that's about it. That's, that's the extent of our ringtone video. Like, um, if you want to... Uh, I know some people do what's in my purse or what's in my bag or stuff like that. Mine would probably have to be what's in Glitchy's bag today. What's, it, mine would be a Capital One commercial. What's in your wallet? Because I, <laughs> I carry around a huge fucking wallet. Yeah, no. Nah, today my purse or my bag. Well, it's not. I don't really call them purses because purses just seem stupid. I just call them a bag because it's a bag. It's a bag I put my shit in. I don't know, purse seems prissy. <laughs> I have such weird stigmas. <sighs> Whatever. Anyways, we will see you guys in the next video. Rate, comment, subscribe. 